Okay. So. First day, man was granted soul and with it clarity. On the second day, upon earth was planted an irrevocable poison. A soul devouring demon. Looking forward to fighting that fucking thing. Were you able to log in and watch the broadcast? Uh, I, I can't really see the broadcast. Uh, so where where is it being held? Go to YouTube. Okay. And type in the Kinky Corner. Uh, how do you spell it? Capital T, and it's H E space, capital K, I N K Y, space.
Alright. You found it? Yeah, I think I found it. Yeah, because it's the title screen being played. It's, yeah, it's Demon Souls. It's just, it's just the yeah. title. Alright, did you get to see the opening cutscene or not? Uh, I've seen the opening cutscene. Yeah, alright. Well, let's go. Yeet! Turn off all my extra shit going on. All right, fam. And thus we begin. All right. I'm not a female, so I guess. Body type B it is. Player's name. Uh. Uh. I always do player name at the end. Just to, because it doesn't like force you in a certain thing. We're gonna go with Donzo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, oh, this is actually a specific one, but, uh... So... Go... I kinda wanna go night. But I don't think I'll have any match if I go night. <laughs> I think I have to go Magician. No, you don't. Uh, go... Y yeah, uh, wait, go to Magician. Is that the right one? Commoner that officially learns spells, skillful, skillfully commands magic spells with high intelligence. Yeah, that's it. Uh, I ain't playing that. That that will actually be very powerful. I always play knight though. I gotta I gotta go with the knife. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh yeah, the specific one. Uh... Where's this item discovery? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of want the proof. Provisional ring. Definitely do the ring. Style B is just in... more of us keeping it's yeah, either it's straight just... back up or just crap, you know, like Style B.
I know this isn't the most exciting part of the game. Eh, it actually is somewhat. Definitely fun, because the creativity you have, you can use, or you can do, is just so much that you can do a lot of things very, very easily. I think you could straight up make the face of a of Shrek. Yeah, I mean, I definitely could, probably.
King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. But the old King Alant had roused the old one, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astraea with her knight Gaal Vinland. And Sage Freak the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. And Boletaria oh, has man. one final hope. The a lone warrior who has braved the That's why tells you the whole freaking like jibbing of one board that had found it safe. Yeah. Or have the demons found a new sleep? But I mean, you don't ever get any like story in these demon souls or dark souls or bloodborne get type games unless Oh you only get them at the beginning. And that's it. You have to do all the NPC quests if you really want to figure out all the rest of the story. Actually no. It's just you have to listen. To the fisher. And understand why you have to do certain things like that. They they tell you. So the they tell you pretty easily, like, what you have to do and that kind of stuff. Yo, that's cool as fuck. This controller is, like, vibrating and stuff. Yeah. It's dope. It vibrates with each step. Wow. the grass to heal yourself okay so square is your item that you have for the bottom of the yeah down. yeah it's use a use item
Okay. Sit one off. Slapped around here. It would damage her for that shit. Alright. Interesting fact, if you actually fall, you can actually roll at the last second right before you're about to land, and actually cancel out all the damage. Alright. But it's a weird one, it's a weird one, like either you have to be a certain NECA heal, NECA stuff. Like certain weight uh, which was in interesting. I don't remember that. I don't know if that actually was. So this game is basically one big game of Dungeons and Dragons. Par partial? Uh... Like, a lot of things that we normally do or play is, has definitely the structure of what D&D &D is. Because D&D mm. &D is just meant to be a like have these and that kind of stuff, but then it's a, but then it's a fantasy. <laughs> Damn, that boy got clapped. You parried him? Yeah. Nice. That's usually how I win a lot of this, a lot of these games. I usually just master the parry system and then... Up and it's you're you're saying that now. Just wait. They said this game was hard, man. Oh my god. Oh, who the fuck are you? Oh, okay. Come here, dude. Come here. Come here. Oh, you cannot be parried. He has a very small, small window. It's only a specific move. Okay. I just pushed that boy back. 
You got clapped on, son. You got roasty rude. This game looks amazing, I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, I see you playing it, I'm like, god damn, them light effects. They are literally being, like, make this game. Because the game originally was already really good, but now them doing this, it's like, here, to prove that graphics only just benefit something, here's something that's great. Bro. The light shining through the tunnel onto my like that's cool. Like you can see the reflection off the metal on the one side yeah. and just nothing on the other. It's Ooh. nice. And another one of you motherfuckers. Let's go then. Time to clap. See, I told you. Yeah. I told you, it's like a specific one. Like he, like it seems like he does a overswing, but when he does a side swing, that's when you can just parry it right off. Gotcha. Yeah, I'll, I'll, oh, I got a dagger? No. Yeah, I'm good with what I got. <laughs> yeah, that's. That's just in any Souls game. Once you start out, you just get a little dagger with you. Or a broken dagger. A lot. Yeah. Yeah, it's got more grass. Yeah. I'll definitely say that game will probably be, I'll probably be very, very, like, decent at it, I'll say that, because, uh, because that was, that one's the only, uh, Souls and Bloodborne game that I didn't get to play. I haven't played Sekiro, but <laughs> it's like, eh, I wouldn't mind it, but at the same time I'm like, oh, I don't really know. Oh. Uh, second row was really good. I really enjoyed it. It just that when it came out was the time when I really had no money or anything like that, so I had to be like, hmm, can't. I think it's on sale right now. That was a game I really enjoyed. Yeah. Enter the fog. Oh, boss fight? No boss fight. Alright, no, then. Uh, so. So this one <laughs> Easy. What have we got? Yeah. Alright, more grass. You know, the big thing of it all is that I'm trying to see, like, when you get to, uh, I'll say this to help you out with at least one important fact. The first boss, save all the fire bombs that you get before you get there, and there's also a secret spot where you can get a, uh, something to infuse your weapon for a second. With fire damage. I ain't got no fire bombs. Oh, what the fuck? Hell yeah! All right, I am into dead. Yeah. Well, that sounds about right. Yeah, I kind of figured as much. Like, 
I literally got fucking one shot. Yeah. That's how it goes. You can actually defeat it on the first go. And you actually get a very, very big reward. For it. Yeah. But, now, but I'm not gonna do that. Well, that's the thing. That boss? Never gonna happen again. That was a one time thing. I believe it. Welcome to your hub. You cannot escape the Nexus. Interesting. However, by capturing Demon Souls, you can reclaim your corporeal body. Alright. Wow. Nice hub. Reminds me of a lot of Dark Souls 3 up in here. Well, that's why Dark Souls 3 was, you know, super, super nice with the that, but also it's because in that in this game, in Demon Souls, it's very much like you have to go out to get certain things, and then you have to come back to help create something to help yourself. Very true. I'm Stockpile Thomas. Mm -hmm. What when they the did. In, came, uh, I didn't know Dark what Souls hit me. 3. When I came to, I found myself here in. This nexus. My wife and daughter fell victim to the demon. Loser! But I would be worthless huh. in battle. At the I will least, say this though. I where you're at right now, I don't know where to go next. Slayers of demons. That's the honest truth. I never played it, but I've always known. I would be happy to up to that point. Where you were at. Excess baggage. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I was also saying that. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. To, I'm gonna go get some sleep because it's five o'clock in the morning for me. No, I know. I'll probably turn this off for the night. Yeah. You are at a good stopping point. Let's say that. Yeah. Probably turn this off for the night and play it more tomorrow and the day after. True. Best of luck to you. But already, I know that you've already, it's like, god damn, super cool and super clean, I'm guessing already. Like, the input delay is so instant. <laughs> there's no there's delay. input delay, man? Like, I haven't felt shit. Like, it is. That's, that's the thing. That's, that's where it is. It's like, you, either an input delay, because like, let's be honest. The PS4, when you're playing all those Souls games on the PS4... There's a delay. You know it is. Yeah. That one, PS5, there's no delay. There's pretty much, ex like, not a single... S there's like a split second... There's not even a split second delay. It's like, probably under a second delay yeah. compared to, like, these are, like, pretty much a second delay. Half a second delay, and so it can... Mess you up, but see, well, that you one, slipped yeah, through the fissure too, did you? You came yeah. from demon souls. I haven't, I haven't felt any to play on any of the games I played on this. And be remembered nice. as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons. Uh, Try uh, I'm gonna one go of the bed. arch stones. No, no. Now go. Yeah. That is why you came, yeah. is it? Yeah. To this accursed yeah, Valentaria. You came for Dima. It's all this. We're welcome here. As long as we keep slash. <laughs> mm. 
you're new here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. Or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, thing. Do come back alive. I need your business. Oh my, how has this happened? Has God abandoned us for King Alant? Failing to show proper respect? Oh, Mbasa. Oh, Mbasa. Damn, she's kind of bad, though.
Interesting. Very interesting game, man. Definitely gonna be playing this a lot more.